hello fellows and ladies uh i'm gonna review shit hello fellows and ladies uh i'm going to now review lightyear which is the latest pixar movie and it is about buzz lightyear but it's not the actual buzz lightyear it's the movie that andy saw that made him want to get the Buzz Lightyear toy. That's what, it's not the real Buzz Lightyear. It's not the toy. It's a weird concept aside. Basically, it's a Buzz Lightyear. Um, it's a sci-fi movie. But sorry, it is kind of, that's kind of it. It's a sci-fi movie, like adventure action movie by Buzz, uh, by Pixar. Like that, it just, you know, Buzz Lightyear. <laughs> you know what I mean? I, what, I remember when I heard this concept and I was like, that's kind of weird, right? Let me just get my uh, swim shorts out of there. I, you know, I kind of thought, well, that's kind of weird. It seems a little cynical, but like it's Pixar. I'm going to give them the benefit of the doubt. And this is a good movie. All right. Let's just get that out of the way. This is a good movie. It is, you know, it's the flaws are there, but it's a good time. I, I, it's that it, I would never, it's like, you know, oh, it's not the best Pixar movie, but it's like, that's I, I think that's an unfair thing. I remember people will shout on Luca for not being the best Pixar movie. It's like, bro, do you understand the bar that is? Like the 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 absolute gargantuan bar that is. I think that's unfair to level that against every single Pixar movie. But yeah, no, uh, Pixar is even Pixar. Like they can be cynical for sure, but like Pixar, even like something like Monsters University, where it's like, yeah, there's some cynicism in its in its you know creation. But, you know, it has heart in it, though. Like, I, I like Pixar when the movies are made with love. And I got to be honest, I, I didn't feel that with this movie. Well, OK, positives first. Let's get the positives out of the way, because there, there are more positives than there are negatives. But I think the negatives are really worth mentioning. To me, first of all, I think the undeniable thing about this film is that it looks beautiful. It is incredible animation. It works like I love like the animation styles of like, you know, turning red and Luca. But for this film the animation needed to look a little bit lifelike and oh it's and it does like the people look real but just in general like the the like all the space shit looks unbelievably beautiful i saw this at imax i recommend everyone to go see this in imax if you're gonna go see it watch it in imax because it is beautiful on that screen if that stupid fucking dinosaur movie isn't taking it honestly to god from my story standpoint for the first two acts i actually was captivated i actually really liked where it was going for a lot of it. I, uh, you know, I, I thought there was some pretty entertaining and interesting ideas. Like this whole has like a Martian-esque feel for the first half. And then it does get a little Pixar, you know, like these ragtag group of heroes got to learn to like be good. It's the Pixar shit. But I was entertained by it. Third act, uh, we'll get to that. And as for the characters go, you know, listen, Chris Evans, I thought it was actually a great idea. For what they're doing, I think Chris Evans was kind of the perfect choice of Buzz. Everyone's like, hey, where's Tim Allen? It's like, I I kind of get why they pit, went with Chris Evans. I'm just saying if the movie came out in 1995, you really should have went with the king, Brendan Fraser. But I kind of like, it's close enough to Tim Allen's voice where it's like, it's not an impression. So you can kind of buy what they're doing with it. And, you know, even with that context aside, Chris Evans just does a great job. Uh, but I think you you all know Socks. Socks is kind of a king. <laughs> you know, for a while, I was like, well, Socks is just kind of a cute cat. And yeah, he's funny, but he's not that like I don't know why everyone's you know loving him. And then and then I got sucked in. I'm like, all right, I, I like the cat. I like the socks cat. It's fun. Tyka's in it. You can't go anywhere without finding Tyka. Tyka's he's everywhere. You walk down the street, it's Tyka over there. Yeah, he was very funny. Everyone was pretty great. It's a funny movie. It's Pixar. I love. I think Pixar Pixar movies do not get enough credit for how fucking funny they are. And this is not an exception. But anyway, I mentioned the third act. <laughs> Listen, I was kind of like, yeah, this is kind of whatever this movie. I'm, I'm entertained. It's interesting. Whatever. And then the third act happens and there's a twist. And I'm just like, hey, uh, can you back up a bit? I was kind I was a little like, um, why? Why are you doing that? It's like, it's a little weird. It's, and it kind of got, it kind of took me out of it. I'm not going to lie. And I, I was just, <laughs> I, again, there's some fun moments in the end, in the third act, but it just kind of, it kind of lost me. It just kind of lost what it was going for. And then I just remembered, oh, wait, this is not the toy Buzz Lightyear. This is the movie that Andy saw that made him want to watch, that made him want to buy the toy, get the toy, because he got his present. I know my Toy Story lore. And I'm just like, what, why did he want the toy after watching this movie? 
so yeah now this is uh definitely not top tier pixar um but it's still you know i I'd still recommend watching it especially with your family go watch it you know what i mean like go watch the shit it's a fun time let's talk oscar so initially i was kind of like you know like all right guys but you're gonna win animated feature let's just stop like let's cut that shit out it's gonna happen we don't i don't want that to happen either it's not gonna but even when the reviews came in it was like you know mixed but like mainly pretty positive even then i was kind of like it's still gonna be it's gonna be light year still and then the box office. I'm filming this um, Saturday morning. So the box office reports are kind of in. And it's not great. It's it's kind of made me, uh, it's going to go, oh, that's not, that's not good at all. It's still Pixar. It could happen still. Like, I'm not going to throw it in like, oh, shit, I guess Lightyear's not going anywhere near a best animated feature nod. But like, I'm not as secure as I was before. It's Pixar. I'm going to assume it could win. That's just how this shit works. But like, I'm not, I'm not going to sit here and tell you, oh, it's a guarantee. Because man, I did not expect this to flop. I really did not. That was, I, I, that was shocking. So yeah, overall third act definitely had some issues with it, but I was, uh, I was very entertained by this movie. Uh, Socks, my king. And yeah, overall, I, I think this movie is entertaining and fun and beautiful to look at i'm gonna give light year i'm gonna go um i don't wanna go too high but you know it's pretty i'm gonna give it like seven socks is out of ten all right that's light year um yeah <laughs> uh, like subscribe to all that shit and uh watch this review and then get the toy version of me that's coming out pretty soon